guys, my name is Leslie, and if you haven't already read my other story, or my other video for some of you, um, this is something a little bit more about myself, and what I'm fixing to talk about is something I never talk about because I hate talking about it, but there is someone I believe out there who needs to hear this, so I'm going to go ahead and say it anyways. For my whole life, I am 13, I have had some pretty serious back problems, and I mean, it has literally killed me. Like every day is a struggle. Ever since I was like two, it has given me problems. Well, I say that it was two, but it caused me to not grow normally like I started walking late than I should have or started crawling later than I should have but uh when I was old enough to walk and talk I would just sit there and cry and hold my back and just tell them to make it quit hurting and I was just three or two and I n never said anything about it that I remember. It. This is just what my grandma has told me. But as I got older, it started to get worse. And my family thought it got better because I waited, let's see, about almost 10 years for me to say something about it. I mean, I was in some pretty serious pain. I was bullied for it. Dear God knows how much I was bullied for it. I can't walk right. I have a back of a 60 year old and I'll walk like an 80 year old. Well, I guess for the 16, 80 year olds who aren't that healthy, but I don't walk very straight. And it, kids would just make fun of the way I walk. And I have this one tender spot at the very bottom of my spine. And all you got to do is touch it. And that will make me hurt for two weeks. And they would literally just punch after punch. Kick after kick. And they would just brutalize it. And I would sit there and I would cry. And when I cried because I'm in pain. You know I'm in pain because I never cry. I don't cry when I'm in pain at all. And it's just really taking its toll on me. And it's very hard, but I know that I can get through it. And my family, they're not very supportive. And they don't realize how bad it is. They think I'm just kidding when I'm not. Like, I'll say it hurts, and they'll be like, okay, go lay down. And I'm like, it doesn't matter what I do, it hurts no matter what I do. And it has gotten to the point where I literally cannot keep my shoulders up, and I just cannot sit up straight. And my grandma or my mom or my dad, they'll just be like, you need to sit up straighter. And I'm just like, okay. So I try to sit up straighter, and I have to force myself to, and when I do that, I am in all kinds of pain. Cause, I mean, I get yelled at if I don't. So, I might as well just go ahead and take the punishment for it. Because either way, I don't know. But, I feel like there's someone out here needing to hear this. And, I hope one of you do hear it and realize that you're not alone. Because... 13 years with a bad back is pretty hard. I've never had any sorts of surgery, but I have had scoliosis and I have fibromyalgia. And, I don't know. It's just very frustrating, but, I don't know. I guess I just had it for so long, it just doesn't really bother me anymore. But that's another one of my stories, and I hope y'all like it, and 
find it inspirational. Bye.